Hey guys, Copy here. Welcome back to the video. And today we are back with the next chord plot. And first thing I want to get started with before I forget is that I want to print every cog that I've loaded. So we're going to go into the uh, for FN and OS list directory thing. And we're going to put cog. Or we're going to do format cog. And then we can do this. We can put FN. And just same thing over here, minus three, loaded. Now if we run the bot, we can go here, uh, recording, here we go, basic moderation and test loaded, we can do S help, and it shows what all we have. Now today, I actually made this last night, so it's a little iffy, but it works, right? So, let me just make this, no, I'm not going to make that smaller then. Uh, here, I'll just move this up here. Okay. Now, I'm doing this because I know I won't remember this by memory. That's why I always have this second screen loaded. As you can see, I have it all right here in my other Visual Studio. Where it's my private bot where I just do the code. And then here's the YouTube bot. Anyways, in the Cogs folder, we're going to make a meme.py. Right. And we can go into our basic. We can copy all this and paste it. Let's name this meme. And let's change all that and then we can do meme test s load meme s oh whoops yeah let's change it to meme s load meme s meme there we go there we go we don't have to restart the bot or anything it's pretty cool now what we're going to do is a couple imports url lib and json now there are already tutorials like this the same way i'm doing it because it's easy it's nice it's fun now what we're going to do is first let's take in the arg and let's make it equal to none just in case we don't have anything right and this is what i'm doing i'm going to do an invite is equal to await ctx dot channel dot create invite max uses yeah but mine's going to be zero so it's infinite right unique is equal to false so it's going to be the same url that would work anywhere else now uh, i will add a help command so we can do if arg is equal to help we pass so else if arg is not equal to help we can do if arg is equal to none pass if, or else pass this is just so i don't get a bunch of errors now i did separate this and this is because i want to keep everything in this section rather than go down because the error i found was every time i wanted to try and do a help module or a help command it would break and where is it see this is me testing it all you can join the discord to see all my testing and whatnot things early here we go it would say test every time i uh, did help then be like command range is an exception unbound look error or whatever that's because nothing was loaded so if we go to recording testing we can do uh api is equal to url lib dot request dot url open i do not want image flip i would want uh https slash slash meme dash api dot heroku app gimme arg dot com slash gimme slash arg in curly brackets and we can copy this put in the none as well well let's get rid of arg let's get rid of these formats not needed there we go now we can do data see what json dot load api all right uh, URL is equal to data URL. And here's something that was outdated that I figured out or fixed. We do name is equal to data. And instead of name, we put title, which I've seen in a lot of tutorials where they put name as well. But it's called title. Uh, poster is equal to data of poster. Uh, sub is equal to data of subreddit and then link is equal to data of post link capital L 
Now let's make the embed. We can do embed is equal to next chord dot capital E embed. Title is equal to name. And then we can do color is equal to, I set it as a green because it looks pretty cool, pretty. So that's a green. Then we can do embed dot set author. We can do, this is just for me, this is mine. Name is equal to ctx.guild.name. URL is equal to invite. And then icon, whoops. Icon URL is equal to ctx.guild.icon. Now that's for me, not other things did that, but I like it. Embed.set image. Then we can do URL is equal to URL. And then we can also do embed.set footer. We can do text is equal to format of poster. Then we can do poster uh, sub and sub. Then link, link, just like that. Then we do await ctx dot send embed is equal to embed. Now what we're doing is let me explain. When we open this link, let me just do this. When we open this link, we get a preview. Sorry, I have some mods down there. That when we open it, we can read post link is equal to the Reddit page or link. When we go to it, this is the meme. It's from Dank Meme subreddit. You can see it's from here as well. And the uh, title, medium rare. And the URL, this is for the image. Exactly. NSF, UW, false, spoiler, false, all of that. Here's the author. This is the creator of the post. Uh, and that's basically it. And it's pretty cool. We get all this data, and we put it all into an embed. Now we can do S... Reload meme, S meme. And there we go. Here's, wait, hold on. Oh, it's author, not poster, sorry. I guess we can change this to author as well instead of poster. There we go. S reload meme, S meme. Excuse me. Context, gilk, whoops, guilt guild there we go let's reload meme s meme this might not work it might yeah it will what is it and here it is it shows the icon of our server shows the name and there's an invite for it it's pretty cool here's the meme and here we go poster is the lonely tackle this is the separate of memes and here's the link if we go to it here it is here it is we get the poster we get the title and we get the meme. It's pretty cool. And this is what I added to myself because it's my server. But if you were to add this bot to your server, it would show your server, not mine. It's it's pretty cool. Um, what else? Okay. Now I want to add a help command. Oh yeah. Okay. S. Now okay. I'm going to show you what this is. Now. We are doing S exclamation mark meme, meaning we can get uh, anything from like three different subreddits. I'm pretty sure, yeah, there's only three. And what was is memes, dank memes, and me IRL. Now, if arg is equal to none, that means it just grabs it randomly, but we need to get specific ones. We can do S exclamation mark meme, and let's do dank memes. And look at that, it's from dank memes. Let's make sure it wasn't a fluke. From Dink Memes. Let's make sure it wasn't a fluke. From Dink Memes. As you can see, you can specify. We can even do me IRL. Me IRL. There you go. And that's pretty cool. So, it's pretty crowded over here. Okay. Let's go over here. Pokemon? Oh, sorry. I don't even know that Pokemon. <laughs> uh, the only person I knew was Mareep. That's the only person I know. Okay, now I want to make a help command, because we can do await ctx.sent or reply test, right? S reload meme, S meme help. 
and see it replies and it doesn't send that because if we were to have this lower down it would go from here to there and skip this and it just wouldn't work it would give the error and that's what i figured out and realized hey that's not right it doesn't work but yeah let's add the help so i also used an embed for this we can do embed is equal to next core dot embed and i actually used a website to help with this because it was just easier but i'm going to type it all for you i will get the link to the website in the description it's pretty well or it's pretty good so let's do title is equal to meme com uh, command help and i do like the color green so let's do color is equal to 0x00ff00 zero 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 zero. let's do embed dot set author let's do the same thing as before because i like having that it's pretty cool we can do embed dot add field Let's just copy this three times. One, two. And then name is equal to memes. Actually here. Name value inline is equal to false. This is just easier to keep up with. Name is memes. This will be the subreddits. And hey, fly. We can do memes. And then we can do think memes and whatever is in value is what I'm saying is what you can use and then we can also do me IRL value is equal to me IRL and uh, I forgot what the little things are called but it's at the top left of your keyboard uh, underneath the escape key and dogs are going crazy it was the mailman anyways where were we making this okay so i forgot what these little things are called but if we go into the discord and type it you can see it gives a little like little thing it's like a code block except this is a code block we can use three and you can even explain pi and then def uh, class hi and then whatever you know that's a code block etc it's pretty cool now Let's do uh, await ctx.send embeds equal to embed. I did miss something, so let's go back. And this is the usage part. Embed.set footer text is equal to usage. S meme and then command. Or I wonder what's the best way to say it's optional? Because over here, I just put it in a little parentheses, optional. Then doesn't really tell you what. Hmm. I don't know. But let's just go. S reload meme. S meme help. There we go. Meme command help. Memes, dank memes, me IRL. Usage memes, and then I, I guess I can say option, but then it's optional. You don't have to do that. I don't know. I don't know what the best way is. My turret wig is now level three. Awesome. See, here's meme. Just wait till you see. Just wait till seeing Greek letters. Some great students seeing letters in algebra and math. I was hoping for numbers. Why are you here, dude? I'm almost out of high school like uh two more years basically and it sucks bro i i can't wait to get out of high school <laughs> anyways this is how you make the embed bot or a uh, meme bot the easiest way and optional but it only does use and only use three of the things and I might look more into it to see what else I could use. Maybe a different API. I'm not sure. But this is generally how you make it. Thank you.